welcome to clickmeproject.com our project title is automatic test case generation from software specifications let's see the abstract the test case genera- generation from the design specification is an important work in testing phase in this project we use uml activity diagrams class diagrams sequence diagrams and use case diagrams as design specification and present an automatic test use case generating approach the approach first randomly generate the diagram in design phase in software development process then by the expressing the data into the uh, prescribed data format into a specific storage data implementation work will further process the input data the developing will takes input as expert data the approach can also be used to check the consistency between the program execution trace and behavior of us uml activity diagrams test driven design tdd and the design driven test are used for the test cases generating tdd generate so many duplicated test cases at the end of the project let's see the explanation uml is a connection uh, common language for business analysis software architecture and develops used to describe the specific design and document extracting our new business process structure uh, and the behavior of artifact artifact of software systems the primary developed for this uh, design phases or design specifications for both the system and test cases for validating the system functionality and performance investigations of the feasibility of future and test are typically part of design process involving in the initial development uh, in the case of validation design the test plan defines the testing necessary to establish the query for the system uh, if the system is process all the testers in the test plane then is declared to be completed if the system does uh, does pass all the testers then is considered to be high quality let's say the data flow diagram first we start our process then go to the open uml when then open the uvm uml software then drawing work then go to uml diagram drawing work then the another state is um, excel data converted into the future works then the then we go to the diagram inclusion when adding the diagrams then go to the parsing data when you parsing data then go to the update into the when the uh, parsing data is updated into the database then go to the nlp work then go to the possible test cases when we when we uh, test the our process let's say the demo of our project first we start our process uh, run home java and then this is a home page is automatic test case generation from uml diagrams first we click the open vm uh, vbb uml software then click class let's see the class diagram and we have the string values and row number and cell number then right side is a uml diagram is a it's a activity diagram is a atm process then click the use case then a string values documentation then cell numbers and the string values and then see the activity use case diagram let's say atm control and the customer let's say i explain the atm control and the customer relationship then click the activity diagram let's say the activity diagram is a string values and the documents and the cell numbers and the row number let's explain the uh, atm let's say the atm control and the customer relationship then click the sequence number sequence diagram and it is also explain the string uh, string value id and the cell number and let explain the atm and the atm card and the customer let a um, in atm verification in atm is the customer send the verification to the atm card then the class card given the automatic network there and the withdrawal money then go to the then click home page then go to the us case diagram and then click the get gathering and, da- and then click the data gathering to gather the data is a cash given and the uh, authentication item verification and the scanning and entering and the actions we performed in the update to update the, the, the 
in the and database then click ok and go to the next step generate the test yes id and database updates are correctly and then click the ascending test cases then go to the home then go to the class diagram then click the get data and the data uh, gathering from the data set then click update the text file when the data is updated in, and converted into the text file then it's stored in the database and your values are updated into the text then click ok uh, let me see the attributes and the operations of class data then click next then, uh, then go to the possible of test cases of UML diagrams then click the generate the test case id it's completed ascending test case then view the ascending test case values then go to the home page then go to the sequence diagram and uh, let's see the sequence diagram reading and uh, updating its initial and the messages then click the data gathering then the data gathering into the text box Insulator, let's see the insulator and the customer and the ATM card and the ATM. Then see the messages from the ATM verification cash by given authentication work and the withdrawal money. Values are updated into the text when um, values are converted into text, then stored in the data set. Then click OK, then go to the next button. Gathering the, then click the gathering the test case ID and click the ascending class, then go to the home. Then go to the activity diagram and click the uh, data gathering. The data gathered from the data set, then update the value. The values are updated into the text. Then go to the next button. And then generating test, generating the, then let's see the generating the test case diagram ID and assigning the test case. Then view the assign the test case detail and go to the home. The value uh, the process is finished. Thank you for listening.